it's FJ from Fire and Steel, and today's showcase I have with me Trafalgar Law's Nodachi from One Piece. This is our battle ready version, and I'm excited to show you guys because this is one of my favorite swords from One Piece, and I'll tell you why in a second. So let's get started. So let's talk about the handle. The handle is a really nice beige and red design here. It's really nice. I love the color, it's actually really pretty. I don't know if it's actually a gold or like a, a very ugly yellow, but like, I don't know, it just works, right? And I like how this like, this middle part here, it ties it all together, I really like it. And now, my favorite part, the guard. It's so fluffy, it's so nice, and I love it. So underneath this fluffiness is actually an actual guard. So obviously it's not actual like full fluff, It's a guard and then on top of it is just nice and fluffy so yeah and now we'll go down to the sheath the sheath is a very nice black sheath with of course the iconic crosses on the side here and then this really nice red bow here that matches like the red on the handle which i think ties it all together really nicely so let's open her up so here it is without the sheath. It's really pretty. Um, because it's a high carbon steel version, it's very hefty. So I have to use two hands. It's not because I'm weak, guys. It's because it's hefty, okay? So again, like all battle readies, don't touch the blade. Don't touch the oil. Reason, you don't want to rust the blade. And it's sharp, common sense. So make sure you be careful. Watch your surroundings. Make sure no one's there. Because it's also like very pointy. Too, so you like you gotta be careful because you might poke someone's eye out not saying that you would but whatever you buy here and do outside of here is not my problem that's on you guys I'm not saying to do anything illegal or anything dangerous I'm just saying it's not my problem after we buy it so yeah it is really good for like having as a decoration in your household cosplaying Obviously you wouldn't take it to like conventions. You would just do like, you know, cool like poses for pictures for your Instagram. Always gotta do for the Instagram feed, you know, and yeah. So that's it for this video, guys. Thank you guys for watching. The link to the sword will be in the description below. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Follow on all of our social media and see you guys next time. Bye. Mm -hmm.